But who are some of the risers that, that caught your eye down there? Well, I, I think one of the easy ones, uh, and maybe my favorite prospect down there overall was Spencer Brown, a uh, big offensive tackle out of Northern Iowa. And when I say big, I mean big. Uh, six foot eight and a half. Yes, six foot eight and a half, 315 pounds. Um, and what's interesting is he's on the right side there and you see him come out hard and he's the one firing down. Look how light on his feet he is. He's chasing that, that running back upfield. He is so low in his stance that he dis, if he's on the opposite side and you, if he's on a right tackle and you're on the left side, you don't see him. You, he's, he's so flexible and that's what's amazing to me. And if you look at his wingspan, yeah, he still has a, an amazing wingspan because he's, he's six foot eight. But it's similar to guys who have those super long arms that are like 6'4", six, 6'5". Six, so the, the kid's got a 500-pound bench press at 6'8". Wow. That's insane. And you, he, so you see him, and, and you know, I know we're, we're not talking about the University of Colorado, but there's still some, probably some Broncos fans that remember Nate Soldier while he was there. He's farther ahead than Soldier was in every aspect of the game. And Soldier's been in the league for 10 years and was a first-round draft pick. So – that's one of those guys to me that really caught my attention. Um, so I'm looking forward to see where he goes. I've seen him go in the first round in a couple of mocks already. It seems like Pittsburgh, the Pittsburgh guys are on this guy. So keep keep an eye on him for sure. Judging from his tape, I get some Mecky Becton vibes just from his size alone. You know, 6'8", just a monster of a, a mauler of a lineman. So that's interesting. 